Uh, welcome back, everyone. Thank you for joining us. This time, the presidential brokies will be making a Doritos tier list. Comment what video idea you want to see next. The rankings go from S tier to trash tier, with S tier being the highest and trash tier being the lowest. Let's kick things off with the classic Mandarin. Ah, Mandarin. It's refreshing. It's citrusy. It's like a vacation for your taste buds. Mandarin, please. We need flavors that represent real Americans. Why are we even talking about Jaredos? I mean, I guess it's decent contender in the orange soda genre. The citrusy bubbles slap and the Mandarin Jaritos is a staple at the bodega stores. If the corner store El Chapo sells Jaritos, they will almost always have Mandarin on deck. A tea air worthy. All right, all right, the Mandarin Jarito is going into A tier. Now on to our next flavor, tamarind. Tamarind. Ah, it's like a burst of tangy sweetness mixed with a hint of spice. It's like the perfect balance between savory and sweet, reminiscent of those hot summer days in the coal mine back in the olden days. It makes me smack my lips and go mua in between each swing of the pickaxe. Is tamarind even a fruit, though? What is it exactly? And how do they get it into the bottle? Tamarind looks like brown, sticky snow peas. But have to admit, this flavor is bold. But it's too adventurous for me. It's a little too intense. Mid-D. Tamarind. It's like a journey back to my roots, you know? The depth of flavor, the richness of history. It's like drinking a piece of culture, rich in antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals. It is believed to aid digestion, boost immunity, and promote overall well-being. Every time I drink a tamarind Doritos, it immediately makes me want to poop. Just for that relief, this should go into A tier. Uh, hmm. Tamarind Doritos is interesting. I appreciate its cultural significance and the depth of its flavor, but personally, I find it a bit overpowering. This is going into D tier. Next up, pineapple. What y'all thinking, boys? Gross, sleepy Joe. I don't need to visualize Jill's stale pineapples. For me, the pineapple Doritos flavor is the OG classic. Slaps. Throw a splash coconut milk in a pineapple Doritos and instant pina coladas. For you know, all the poor people who will never experience a real pina colada served up to you while roasting to an appropriate Donny Orange hue. My perfect day. Arriba. The pineapple Doritos sends tingles down my spine. The tropical juiciness of the pineapple really comes through in this Doritos bottle. Almost as delightful as sucking on Jill's pineapples. Ha ha, I still got it. Bow chicka wow. Wow, this is S tier worthy. Undisputed S tier. Finally, you boys are making doggone sense. The pineapple Doritos reigns supreme. Up next, apple Doritos. Apple? Seriously? It's like biting into a crisp, juicy slice of heaven. It beats all of the other Doritos flavors. You better believe me. I'm the master farmer of the big apple, New York. See, I know my apple flavors. I'm a connoisseur of all things apple after all. Whoa, slow down there, D. Apple's good, but it's not blowing my mind. The mild apple flavor in this Doritos bottle misses the damn mark. It just tastes like fizzy apple leaf water. D tier for me. You know, I'm gonna have to agree with Obama on this. Apple's all right, but it's nothing to write to the farm about D tier for me. Wow, I didn't know such an unassuming fruit in soda form would get so much hate. I'm only placing this Ginto D tier instead of trash tier because Donnie Boy was going to the mat for this flavor. Now let's mix it up and talk about where all the Doritos fruits mash together, creating the undeniable fruit punch flavor. Thoughts? Fruit punch, baby! It's like a party in a bottle bringing all of the artificial flavored fruits in one spot. S tier. I love drinking this almost as much as Mexican Coke because we all know Coke is made best by Mexicans. I gotta agree with you there, D. Fruit Punch is a classic crowd pleaser. My speed take. Fruit Punch is all right, but it's a little too sweet for my taste. I'd rather drink cough syrup. Harsh take, Barack. This Doritos flavor is sweet, tangy, and totally refreshing. A tear. Now, Limon. Ah, uh, it's like a burst of sunshine in every sip. Tangy, refreshing, and just the right amount of zing. A tear. I have to agree with the Don on this one. Lime is like a little slice of citrus paradise. It's bold, it's bright, but whenever I drink this, my brain short circuits and I think, am I drinking lime soda or lemonade? A very confusing experience for my taste buds and my brain. Lime is a classic, no doubt, but it's a little too sour for my taste. I drink in this gives me a tummy ache. Wah, trash tear. It's okay, I guess, but it's not exactly my cup of tea. And this also makes my tummy freak out with the lime fizziness, trash tear. 
Up next, guava. Guava? Now we're talking. It's like a tropical vacation in a bottle. Sweet, juicy, and absolutely delicious. Seriously elevated Doritos flavor. Guava, huh? It's a bit too exotic for my taste. I prefer something a bit more mainstream. Whack flavor. And again, I ask, what the hell is this fruit anyway? It's like a pear trying to be an apple and trying to be tart. D tier. What are you smoking, D? You're confused. Guava is like a little slice of paradise. It's unique, it's flavorful, and it's definitely deserving of A tier. Guava, it's all right, I guess. But it's not exactly blowing my mind. I could take it or leave it. I'll go with C tier. And now for our final flavor to judge today, Mango Doritos. A mango? Well, slap my diapers off and call me surprised. That sounds downright delicious. Watermelon, ahem. I mean mango. Bape boop bop. Jesus Christ. Joe is having another episode. We better wrap this up quick before Joe runs out of juice. Oh yes, the mango Jaritos never disappoints and always find myself happy and calm after chugging a bottle. Give me a mango Jaritos any day. It's bold, it's tropical, it's the taste of victory. Mango is good. It's a refreshing flavor that never fails to please. Speaking of which, I'm sipping on one right now. Solid flavor. Have to agree, I love sitting on my rocking chair looking out onto the ranch with mango Jaritos in hand. This one gets an A tier. This was a great debate amongst the three presidential brokies, and we thank you all for watching. Hit that bell notification so you can see when we drop new videos, and consider joining the group membership so that you can vote on polls and what direction the channel will go in. Also, if you didn't know, we are real estate agents in New Jersey and New York states. That's why we're so broke. We work on 100% commission, but our contact info is in the description as well in case someone wants to work with some real deal closers. Another thing, we also have a full tutorial for people who want to make faceless AI videos, and the link to access that knowledge is in the description. The power is in the people. Have a great night.